shipping. I know it's hard. I know, I know, I know, I know. But you guys can do this. Nothing is too hard for you. We've all been there. And trust me, I've literally found the holy grail when it comes to shipping. Guys, guys, listen to me. This kind of race on shipping, where have I been? I'm <laughs> like, Hey Benji Bays, welcome back to my channel. We're all about owning our minds and owning our lives. And in today's video, guys, you will be learning how you can get discounted rates for shipping items to your customers, as well as how to get USPS free shipping supplies right to your doorstep. So if you guys are interested, make sure you guys stay tuned. Initially, I was using USPS straight, like no discount, nothing, and I could have saved so much money, but it's all right. We live and we learn, but I'm gonna show you guys how I get discounted rates and how to get free USPS shipping supplies right to your doorstep. Make sure the like button down below since you got this far in the video. Cheers to you. Cause some of y'all be skipping through these videos and I don't like that. I don't like that. But yeah, let's get it. All right guys, so now you just wanna go on USPS.com over to their website and then you're gonna look for stamps and supplies and then you're gonna scroll down and you'll see somewhere where it says free shipping supplies you're gonna click on that and then what you're gonna do is once you click on get free shipping supplies you'll see a list of different you know packaging and you know different a variety of different boxes that you can select to be shipped to your house so you want to go ahead and just scroll and see you know what exactly it is that you want to order i'm going to show you guys um different box sizes so you can get an idea of the shipping boxes that i use um you can always order and see which one works for you but um these are what i use to ship my products in okay so i usually use a priority mail flat rate envelope so that's exactly what i'm going to get here and you can see that it's a pack of 10 so I go down and I select how many of the pack of tens that I want and I'm going to get, well, I, I usually use these a lot. So I tend to order a bunch of these. Um, if you need uh, questions about the description, you can scroll down and look at the description. And so I'm going to go ahead and grab, let's just say 30. So I put three, add to my cart and then I keep shopping. So I'm going to go down back to the supplies and then I'm gonna scroll down and then it's best to just click on the product type which is free shipping supplies so you don't go ahead and order something that you know you have to spend money for so that's usually what I do I click on free shipping supplies scroll down to see what I want to use next and then I definitely use the priority mail padded flat rate envelope um, I use that when I ship out two of my products so I'm gonna go ahead and grab that and that ships in a pack of 10 and a pack of 15. So you can go ahead and see full details. Do the same thing, you add the quantity amount that you want. I'm gonna get four of the packs of 15. And I'm just gonna keep going and shopping. I'm gonna keep on shopping. So back to the site, or um, the supply site, and then I'm gonna go ahead and let's see. I'm looking for the, uh, well, I do get the large flat rate boxes, so I'm gonna go ahead and get the flat rate box, the large flat rate box, and that ships in a pack of 25. Um, I do this when I ship 10 of my orders, so like 10 usually goes in this box, so I usually get this box. So I add that to my cart, so you can get priority mail stickers, you can get um, special handling fragile, you can get even the address labels. The small custom declaration pouch is for when you print a label from your computer and um, you just wanna put the slip inside of it, you can go ahead and do that. It's, it's gonna be a clear slip, so you just put the paper into it, your paper label into the slip, and you stick the slip onto the box. So this is great if you don't have a thermal printer that sticks, you can just print on printing paper and throw the paper in this slip. So this is, this is what I used to use before I got the printer. All right, so this one always has a limit. So you can only get five, so you get 50 per order. And then I go ahead and 
look i'm going i'm going to look for the medium flat rate i get a bunch of these so because i ship a lot of six packs so um i'm looking for that but they have a bunch of stuff like guys everything like certified mail receipts everything you need from usps they have online so this is really a great resource to utilize all right, so I'm going to keep shopping here, but while I pick out everything, I'm just going to show you guys the actual boxes and what they look like, okay? They can give you a bunch of these. So you put all your orders in it in, in here and you just load it up in the car. So I love. So once you're done ordering everything you need, you just go ahead and check out. And that's it. That's all guys. My products don't need customized packaging, so that's why I use USPS packaging. And um when I don't use USPS packaging, I use UPS, but I have those already pre-packaged in a brown box. But um these were great guys you know you can package it neatly inside the box you can actually put your cute design stuff in the box if you want to be cheaper especially by weight so these are flat rate i always do flat rate because shipping anything over one pound usually ends up being like ten dollars but you can save money by just using the flat rate boxes okay so what you have to do is pretty much go on stamps.com and then it'll, it'll prompt you to go to ShipStation. And with ShipStation, you can literally, you know, connect your store to do this. I use WooCommerce. I know Shopify, you can actually print your labels through them. Um, but I just go in on ShipStation and print out my labels from there. Um, just like to see where everything is. It's just so organized. I'm telling you guys, I used to use USPS. And I was spending so much money because I was paying the regular rate. But with ShipStation, you get a discounted price okay it's amazing guys <laughs> like some of my customers have been so discouraged in buying a large quantity only because the shipping rates were so high so now i've contacted them again to let them know listen shipping rates have gone down let's go let's get it let's get this money and they're so happy so if you guys want to provide your customers with the best pricing with shipment this video is perfect for you i'm going to show you guys how to do the orders i'm going to walk you through it if this is something that you feel like I can't do, don't worry, take your time. Like this is something that you will figure out, but you have to give yourself patience, time to do it, okay? It's a learning process. You won't just learn this all in one day and just become, you know, the best and the expert at it. It takes time, okay? I've been doing this for over two years now, so I'm pretty much very familiar with how to ship products, okay? So now we're gonna log into ShipStation. All right, guys, so let's start a new order together. We're going to go to new order, and then we're going to just input all the information that we need for this customer's order. So let's just make it up. So we're going to say the shipping paid was $8. The tax is $1.40, and then the total paid was $29.40 just for the total of everything. So you're going to fill out the name. 
their address and you're gonna go down to order line items and put exactly what it is that they ordered. All right, so now you can see, you know, where is it going? Make sure the address is validated and their email, and then you can see what item you're sending out to them. So it has everything there listed out from product to tax to everything. So now we're gonna select the service we're gonna ship with. Let's just say for this example, we're gonna use USPS priority mail, and then we're gonna ship it in a flat rate envelope. All right? And it tells me that the rate is $7.15. Usually for confirmation, I like to put de delivery confirmation. I think I forgot to do it here, but yeah. And then you, I usually like to compare pricing just to see, you know, if I did it a different way, if I used UPS ground shipping, would it be cheaper? But here you can see that it's actually more expensive. And see, you doing just a USPS priority mail is definitely more expensive than, than using a flat rate envelope. So that's why I like to do flat rate envelopes. So now we're just gonna create and print the label and then just gonna print it and stick it to the box and there you go. And like I was saying before, you can actually go on stamps.com and do this because stamps.com is actually connected to um, ShipStation. So sometimes when I'm having a problem using Ship station, I just go on stamps.com. So you can see the breakdown of the different pricing. So the flat rate envelope, it tells you all the details next to it. So you just hover over it and you can see, you know, all the details. So if you have questions about the packaging, can you use it or not? All the information is right over when you hover over it, okay? All right guys, so I've showed you guys how you can go right ahead online and order these free shipping supplies right from the comfort of your home. All right, if you guys have any questions, or about stamps.com ship station or about how to get the free boxes on usps please feel free to dm me on instagram and let me know i'll be glad to help you guys out i know this can be very challenging especially if you're new to online business especially if you don't know how to connect your store to the the software it's just it can be hectic okay trust me i get it like you know, watch videos online before you contact me though, cause it's a step to, it's a way, it's online. Everything that you need to know is online. Like how to plug your store in, all this stuff you learn online. So feel free to contact me if you have any questions additional to anything that I've explained to you guys. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys in my next video. Ah! Ooh, finally did I eat this Popeye sandwich. Ooh. It's a little cold, I think. Mm. 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 Subscribe, like, comment. Share. Mm. Mm. They did something here.